Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to ServiceNow 911. In the series of most viewed community questions, I have a very basic question for you. Let me go to that question. This is the difference between G user has role and G user has role exactly. This question is being asked by many members of ServiceNow community in one way or another. So I have created this wonderful article where I have explained these two functions in a practical way. So let me show you the same via this video. So let's go to the instance. So what I did, I have created one client script. So this is my client script and this is script is on incident table. And this script is an all load script. And I will go according to this article. So in the very first test case, I am right now logged in as an admin and I have these two alert boxes which I will put in my script okay so what actually happening here in the very first alert I am using hash role and I am adding ITIL then hash role SNCMDB editor and then SNC internal these are the three role which are used by hash role here and then the same role has role exactly okay so the conditions are ITIL and service now CMDB editor both are the role which are in sys user has role so let me open my user account this is me profile uh, let's change the view so the table sys user has role is nothing but this table okay so let me open this here it means these role are specifically assigned to my account okay so let me see if we have these roles Yes, this is here and ITIL is also here. Okay. And now let's reload this. Let's see what will happen. So the very first alert is true, true, true. Remember the very first alert was for has role. And then we have true, true, false. Okay. That is for has role exactly. So let me check the code now. So yes, the user has ITIL role. It is true. The user has CMDB editor role. That is also true. We have seen these roles here, right? And it is also showing true for SNC internal. This role is not there. Let me show. This role is not here. But still we are getting true. Okay. So this is the bug or you can say the way it work. Okay. The way has role work. And then we have this has role. It was true. This was also true and this was false because this role is not assigned exactly to this user. That's why it is showing you false. So what I have observed whenever the admin is logged in, no matter what happen has role always provide a true value and has role exactly will always work in a perfect sense. It means if the role is there in this table corresponding to that user then only it will return true otherwise you will get a false value so now let us check this with a non admin user let me open his account first of all to show you so the user which I have used is able tutor so let me open Abel's account Let's open his role. He has total 30 roles. So ITL is there. Now we are coming on this one non admin user. So there is one more role. I have provided action designer. So let's see action designer is here or not. It's not there. Okay. So we have to update this script with respect to action designer. Let me save it. So now let me impersonate to Abel Tutor. Now let me refresh this. Let's see what will come. So the very first one is true, false, false. And then also true, false, false. So now you see here when the user is non admin, in that case, has role is also work exactly as has role exactly okay there is no difference in the working of these two functions the only problem lies when you have the admin role so you have to be very careful when you use this function 
because it may impact when you are an admin otherwise it is working as simple as that so you can go through this article in a more detailed manner every aspect is being explained here properly look at the last one which i think a most weird thing testing with a role name opsync so what i did i added some role which is of name opsync so look at the result as an admin it is giving it true i don't know from where it is picking that opsync is not a role this is just a text so it is a completely false so service now has to look into it i think it's a bug and then has role exactly will work properly and then when i tried it as a non admin i get satisfactory result in both the cases it was same so i hope the difference between these two functions is now very well clear to you all i hope you like it if you have any question let me know in the comment section go to this website and check out these amazing content which i am publishing after testing it properly you see this trademark here it means i am testing each and every line of code which i am providing here so this is it for today's video see you next video thank you so much bye bye